Hi everybody! So this is just a help video for finding the longest word in Python. So what I will do is that I will start Python idle and work in the objective mode. So let us start working on the file now. So if I take x and I'm taking input from the user So it asks me words and I will say hello there. The value of my variable x is hello there, which was taken from the user. But if you try to find out what the type of x is right now, it will tell you that it is of class string or str. So it is actually one string, hello there. But we want hello and there to be strings, uh, separate strings, so that we can compare which one is the longest. So there is a function for strings called split. We can use this function. Uh, once you use it, you will get two strings in our list. So now if you try to find out the type of x dot split, it will say class list. So now this is a list. I'll create a new file. So once you have the list, let's say you have x, which takes the input from the user. You should say the proper words which are given in the assignment. So, enter words. Once you have this, what you need to do is that first you need to define a function here. Once you do that, you will use some other variable like x, y, z. You should name your variables with a better word, like a more meaningful name. So x, y, z is equal to x dot split. x, y, z will have a list. What we do is that, let's say I'm defining a function called print words, which takes a list. I'll say word list. And here I use for i in word list print i. And that's it. If I save this and hit F5, Um, so I need to call my function print words xyz. So each word is printed. What you need to do is, I'll just put some comments here.
Um, make an empty string variable. And in the for loop, instead of printing, what you need to do is for each i, I'm saying i here because I have the variable i here, you can say, you can have another variable such as word, like you can call it whatever you want. So instead of i, I will say word, which is a better name for the variable. So here I would say for each word, compare it to the previous word and find the longest word. Save uh, the longer word in the variable. So I have this variable. Um, so I'll make a variable and I can call it longest word. So we have the longer word in the variable longest underscore word. So what you can do is that here, maybe you can use an if condition where you compare both of the words. So the first time the word will be empty. Uh, whichever word comes, like for example, I had, I, if I have hello here, uh, the first word is hello. So right now my longest word is empty or zero. So of course, uh, hello is longer than empty. Hello will be assigned to longest word, but next time the longest word variable will have a value equal to hello, and then it will compare to the next word which is there. So we try to find which word uh, is longer, and I'm not giving any code so you can try it yourself. But I'll give you the structure and you can find out how to do it. And here once you're done with all the for loops, um, or all the words, what you need to do is return the longest word. So after your for loop is done, you have compared all the variables, all the strings, and you have found which one is longer, you can return the longest word. And you can also see here, what you can do is that you can use a function called len. Um, len takes an object and returns this variable. So what you can do here is we can print word. So we have a word and a word's length. So let's try it and see what happens. So hello has a length of five. One, two, three, four, five. Uh, oops, I forgot to put a space, so it is a longer word, which is length 9, and Python is length 6. So, you can use this and compare these, and find the length in which one is longer.
Hopefully it will help you out and let me know if you still have problems. Thank you.